Okay, time to play Tale of Enki Pilgrimage. Has nothing to do with the Tales of series, of course. Alright, there is no guide for this game, so I'm probably going to be very lost for the most part. I'm going to, going to do it this RPG Maker style. Yeah, for the keyboard that is. Music and sound. I'm guessing sound refers to sound effects. Hmm. How slush I have it? Everything at 7 for now. That seems like a safe bet. Okay, view manual. I already took a. I already skimmed it. So let's start a new game. Arg, Gargan, Gur. Ugh, time to get up then. Is there a run button, or do you just move at a constant speed? It's a shelf filled with various herbs, spices, and other things that aren't worth my time. There's nothing in this pot. Contained 100 coupon. Sounds like coupon. Received 7 coupons. Don't mind if I do. Can I save whenever I want to? Journal. Quest progress. Free power, nine armor, one agility, four move. He seems like the defensive type. He has a natural bonus to his strength and is well suited to physical damage. His usage of nature magic provides him with some decent support abilities. Gargan, a young ogre who departs home to learn what it means to be a man. Why does he have free weapon slots? How does this work? What's the difference between equipment and status? Items, quests, and key. Wait, does everyone only get a set amount of item slots or something? No party members. Nothing in this pot anymore. I don't see a save point. I'm not gonna quit the game. Oh, you're finally awake, dear. Gup gup. About damn time too, it's almost midday. Yeah, whatever, what's your breakfast? What was that? You little rat. Oh no. Nothing. No, not this time. I'm sick of your laziness and that disrespectful attitude. Get out of my house. Fine, I have nothing to do all day. You want me? I'll be napping at the river. I think you misunderstood me, my worthless son. Get out of my house and don't come back until you learn some manners and how to be useful around here. I'm sick of your freeloading. Gargoyle! No, Yurza, enough is enough. He's a man now and he needs to be taught a lesson. Gargan, I don't expect you to, to see you back here for at least a few weeks. Ugh. Get out of here and don't come back without something to prove you've grown up. You're a man now and you make no effort to feed yourself, get a job, or start a family. If you don't come back, then so be it. It's no loss to me. Mother. You know it isn't my decision, honey. Listen to your father. This seems extreme. Can I just do chores? Extreme would be to cut your head off, but I'm no monster. This is the easy way to get back in my good graces, so I suggest you take it. K 
Can he at least say goodbye before he leaves Nurzov? I'll allow that. As soon as you leave the village, the doors are closed to you until you prove you're a man. Fine, but you're going to look like a fool when they get back. Fine, that'll mean you won't be completely hopeless. Go. Silence, it's for his own good. Useless potions. Probably light during the evening. Firewood. Oh, I've trapped enough firewood that I'm sick of the sight of it. Gup, gup. Just an empty barrel. Put a potion of health. Nothing in this pot. Why are they all facing one direction? Didn't I tell you to get out of here? I'm sorry, dear. This time, I think your father is right. It's time you grow up. How to prove him wrong? Storing a family would take too long, so would running a farm. What's father's greatest ac accomplishment? He's always talking about the pilgrimage he took to the temple of Yoltan. I've got it. I'll one of him and actually bring back Yoltan's sacred war horn. He'll regret ever teaching me how to fight once I show him I'm better than him. I need to make my way to Wrightport, but that's Enkian territory. I don't even know the way. I'll see if anybody in Nerzef knows it. The inn, maybe? Gargoyle's house. Who left this here? Mine now. Someone put their secret savings inside a bush. It's a purple mushroom. Perfectly edible, but perfectly bland. It's a red mushroom. Highly toxic but tasty if cooked. Even the bushes could can potentially contain treasure. Potion of health again. No, it stacks. Good. I was afraid it would just keep taking up space as I find more potions and not consume them. Highly toxic, ugh. Greetings, young ogre. Do you have time for a tale? I'm a bard extraordinaire. What's an Enkian doing out here? Sure, sing me a song. It better be good. When you fight, young warrior, please line up your attacks. Then you will execute at once and never look back. What does that mean? It means that when you're fighting, you can target the same enemy multiple times or different enemies. Then once you plan that, you must perform an execution. I see. Noted. I'm working on some new tunes about status effects too. Unfortunately, the text does not scale well to higher resolutions, it would seem. There's... So it's a little bit hard to read. Some of the text just looks kind of broken. And also, where's, uh, where's the save option? Oh no. S preset enemies with no save point. Can I win this? Don't touch the communal treasure chest. Okay, seriously. Is there really no way to save at all? I think I could save by talking to a bed or something. No. Alright, I guess I have no choice but to go out there and hope I don't die before reaching the first save point. Level 1 Woodcutter Axe! Unarmed! Unarmed does not seem very strong. This is a basic unarmed attack. That's 1 stamina, 2 stamina. Oh shoot! Execute commands, huh? 1 attack was enough? 
And I only got two coupons. Communal chest. 20 coupon? That's a lot less than this. Oh well. Wait a minute, is there a punishment for touching that? I have no clue. I hope not. Because there's no save point and I can't really redo it. Execute. Okay. Wait, you got the drop on me? That's not fair. Oh shoot, I don't- my, my hit points are measured in actual- in just hearts. How do I heal? It's not good. Yeah, this battle system is not like the others. It's not like I start with 100 hit points or anything like that. Nope, I have exactly 6 hit points. Kind of like Legend of Zelda, maybe, except that there's no quarter of a heart or anything like that. But I'm afraid if I... Wait, is, are, do I get experience points? I don't think so. But is this, is the, this seems to be the only way to... Ow. Why are they so much faster than me? Ah. I'm already halfway dead. I may have to start avoiding enemies here. Red potion under a rock. I may be forced to use it at some point. Hmm. Inventory. Heals and permanently increases max hit points, but something that valuable, I'm not sure I want to waste it just yet. Maybe I should save it for someone who has less hit points. Welcome to the village of Nurza. Tasty carrot. Wait a minute, do, do these respawn? Carrots. Small hit, hit point recovery. The enemies respawn, but do the carrots? No. One of the better things about Nerds Up is that there aren't that many wolf riders around. They make hunting harder. That's the darn truth. Why? Are you stupid, boy? They have fast and vicious wolves they can ride around on. I've yet to master it and I doubt you ever will. How's it going, Gargan? I've been kicked out of my home. At least you have a home. I sleep in the bushes. Is that the what? Is that why you're always in that ragged underwear? You're broke? Yes, how do you not know? Never really cared. What do you want, Gargan? Donate 10 cu uh, coupons. Here, have 10 coupons. You look pretty pathetic. Really? Well, thank you. Alright, I can Is there a, a reward for donating a certain amount? Okay, I didn't see anything in the achievements about it. Okay, this dialogue is the same, so... It's in this house. But it's you. What are you doing in here, Gargan? Shouldn't you be eating or sleeping somewhere? Doesn't Peachy need a walk? It's always a pleasure, old man. Grim guts. Yes, yes, go on your way now. If you're looking for something to do, Ma's trying out some soup recipes. 
Well, now if it isn't if it isn't young Gargan, it is. Such a nice young man. Will you do an old lady a favor? There'll be some tasty treats in store for you if you do. Of course. What do you need? I need you to bring me a carrot. I'm making some soup. There's a bowl of it with your name on it if you do. Is that what's in the journal? I have a lot of carrots right now. Tasty carrot? Wait a minute. Do I smell a carrot? That's a strong nose you've got there for an old lady. You could have used the carrot that was in your own house, you know? You're such a funny young man, Gargan. You're helpful too. Your parents must be so proud. They absolutely are. Here's that soup I promised. Carrot soup. I hope it doesn't go cold or expire or anything. If you have the time, bring me three more. I'm working on a new recipe and there will be another meal in it for you. Really? Three carrots. How many do I have now? Seven. I can spare it. Do I smell more carrots? That nose of yours scares me, my grim guts. That's uh, so funny. I don't know why my husband gives you such a hard time when you visit. He's an old grouch. He definitely is. He definitely is. Here's that new recipe I've been working on. Delicious carrot soup. Well, if, th if that's all... Next, I'll need three more carrots and a piece of broccoli. Broccoli? That I cannot give you. Is there any broccoli in this house? Locked. No... No broccoli. This is going to be a long-running quest, huh? Two different soups. It also restores stamina. Empty barrel. Sword? He cannot equip swords. Who would ever use a bow? It's a weapon fit only for Locor and Volpa. Red potion, green potion, I want them, but it's locked. Useless potions, very herbs, spices. Talk. Sheep are here are shrewd businessmen and incredibly resourceful traders. Be careful when making deals with them. They might rip you off. So I have to haggle? Are you looking to make a purchase of something to consume? Some armor, perhaps? I'm afraid I don't have much in the way of accessories or powerful weapons. Just some basic armor. Why, why do some of them look the same? They seem to have the exact same effect. Really expensive, too. Hmm, without experience points, there's the only way you can really grind this through money. Hey, you! Say that axe, young ogre. I've done nothing to you and don't want to have to spear you through the gut. Hey, Have I spoken too soon? Yes, why are you so jumpy? I'm at a loss, my friend. I've actually... Actually, I don't care. I need your help, Enkian. I'll listen to you in exchange. I'm not sure how that's a fair deal. First, tell me what you want. If I agree, you, then you listen to my woes before we take any action. Fine, whatever. I'm trying to get to the Enkian village of Wrightport and want guaranteed safe passage. You know my people won't attack you without just cause, right? I've barely left this village before. I have no idea. Why do you want to get to Wrightport? According to my father, it has a pathway to a temple of one of our most famous war heroes, Yolten Brutal Scar. And Kian set up a village there a few years ago and I thought it was off limits. You're surprisingly sheltered. Very well, I can guide you. But first, you're part of the bargain. Yeah, fine. Well, I'm an aspiring knight and want to eventually ascend to being a paladin of Joran. Unfortunately, the Order of Joran here in Calf Rule are too willing to make compromises with criminals. So? No compromises. Huh? Sorry, I lost my cool. I'm just passionate about ensuring justice prevails as soon as possible. 
I don't like the idea of letting one criminal go free in order to capture another. Both could be captured, but that would mean going back on a deal and... Yeah, sounds good. Right, let's go. Your enthusiasm is wondrous. Direction? Through the woods to the northeast into the town of Lindum. Alright, let's go. Rook Yanis, the Lightbringer. I'm waiting for the title stick. You are... Gargan. Ogres need to earn last names. Fair enough. To each his own. Well met, Gargan. Rook has joined the party. Status. Knight armor. He has a lot, a, a bit more agility. And magic. Less stamina. As an Inkian, Rook has low stamina and high base hit points. His usage of r radiant magic provides him with a few good support abilities and decent damage potential. Agrius Meticulous, please leave me be. Fine, be that way, jackass. Gorgon, can you even afford to stay here? You ever tried rent reading a book? You could learn some thing. You know, I know you constructed that secret base nearby that you claim to be good, but it's nothing like building a house. Find a good crafting manual. How do I save? Is there even- there is a save option in this game, right? Unless it auto-saves or something. Well, we can't go back here. 20 coupons. Potion of health. Okay. Anything else? Surprisingly, Enki is okay with me stealing this stuff. Buy room. How much? Peasant room is a low quality. Is low quality and will heal you, you, four hit points. The standard room will heal eight hit points. Normal room is great quality and will heal sixteen. Master is the best quality and will heal all. So peasant room. Only one uh, coupon. Um, who did I see in that one? I thought it looked like there weren't two people. I wish someone would teach me how to save my damn game. Yeah, I'm not gonna spend it all on you. Ugh. Let's see. This armor is really expensive. Let's see. Armor bonus zero. This thing is pr it's practically... He's practically naked! Armor bonus one. That's slightly better. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, I can buy a broccoli here, actually. Okay, let's go to the old lady and give her her broccoli. Do I smell more carrots than a piece of broccoli? Are you a natural nature magician? Can you sense this stuff? You should have a regular spot to end. You make plenty of money from the patrons if you, do a, if you did a comedy act. I'm not making jokes. I don't get it. I've added a few extras to this recipe. It'll do wonders for your health. Exquisite carrot soup. This smells potent. Well now, you run along and enjoy. Wait a minute. Why is she still asking that? I only I only have one carrot left. Damn. 
Okay, seriously, how do I save? Good day, Gargan. Would you like to be the first to participate in my new business? What's that business? I allow people to travel back to places they've already been once before. That doesn't sound like a particularly good business model, but what do I know? You scoff? You pathetic little failure? How dare you? Sorry, I lost my temper. I strongly believe that you'll find this service very useful. How does it work? I'll have a station set up in most of the towns in Calf Roll. Just come talk to me and I'll allow you to return to a few different towns. Can you take me to Rightport? No, Travel Wolf here doesn't work like that. He's very stubborn and he doesn't like going to Enkian towns at the best of times. I'll test your business if you can take me to and from Rightport. Once I finally reach there. Deal? Fine deal. Now get going. Okay, more buildings, huh? Where, what's north? Pray to the altar of Croft so your deeds will be remembered. Record your deeds? Yes, I guess you're the save point. I have to save specifically by talking to the, these altars. I was getting worried there. I wasn't going to be able to actually do anything about my save file and I have to beat the whole game with no deaths. Okay, what's here? Anyone gonna grow anything here? Nothing in the pot. Empty barrel. There's gotta be something if there's a back room. Not so clever now, Mr. Wizard. I have a potion. Very serves that aren't worth my time. Hmm. Oh, it's you, Gargan. Are you finally going to take me up on the magic lecture? I guess I should now that I've been kicked out. I got kicked out at 12. Count yourself lucky. You lost it to 15. It was a blessing in disguise. You, you learned so much fending for yourself. Now, let's begin. For us intelligent folk, we can only harness the magic of the world through the use of crystals. Much like a weapon, you must place it in your hand in order to wield it. The element of the crystal is determined by the color of the magical essence inside. The level of strength is determined by how full the crystal is and the shine it gives. You see my markings? Do you know what they are? They're fire magician markings. I'm not as clueless as everyone seems to think. Yes, most of us ogres will mark ourselves with our elemental preference if we take the path of the magician. Now, it's time for you to get your own. Nope, I don't want any orange tattoos. A spell, you fool, not tattoos. Here, take this basic nature crystal I've, I've been saving for you. Really? If I just listened to your lecture years ago, you have given me this? No strings attached? Yes, we nerds of villagers take pride in serving our community. Thanks then, I'll try it out. Level 1 Earth Shield. Boosts armor of the target by two points for three turns. Huh. I guess if I use if I spend two stamina, then I can get both of them buffed up. If I get more stamina, I could probably even buff it the entire party by draining all my stamina. Okay, I don't think there's... Wait a minute! What about... What about Rook? Doesn't he have any magic? I thought he said something about light magic or something like that. Overwrite this. May want to consider getting some armor and farming off screen, huh? Since the, since the peasant rate is so low, I might as well. Before I do any serious grinding, I might as well check out the rest of the homes here. <coughs> hey, Wolf, well, isn't young Gargan? You've turned into a strapping young man. On the booze again, Marga? 
Huh, I may have had some. Will you mind lending me some money? I'm near broke and only have one bottle left. No. Fine, get out of here. Bottle of booze. Hello, my alcoholic friend. Do you see how I found your chest? Gargan, my sash, put it back. No, I've got something better in mind for this. Both of these choices suck! Smash the bottle. That way she won't be able to get drunk on it? I don't know. Because both options both options really suck, let's face it. This has plagued you long enough. My booze, what have you done? There's no smashing sound effect? You're a friend of my mother's. I don't care for you, but I'm doing you a favor. But what? Take this as your chance to quit. I don't think I can. I don't even know if I want to. You're a laughing stock around here. You wasted all your money and... Dungeon is too business focused to refuse to sell you. You're right, you're right. Now don't be an imbecile. Take this as a wake up call. Okay, ugh, your methods are scary. Take this. I was actually going to pawn it for more money. Save us if I don't have it anymore. Emily of Resist Poison! After all, I've heard from yours about how she thinks she's raised you poorly. I think she's not done as badly as she thinks. Probably not perfect. You're very lazy, but there's hope. Twenty percent chance to resist poison. That's an actual status effect, huh? Is everyone gonna have a quest? You better save. Next house. Nothing in the pot. Empty barrel. Normal firewood. Croft, a god of violence, brutality, and murder. He represents some of the more foul acts that can be seen in the world. He is revered by the ogres as he shaped them from a previous form and passes brutality on to them. He resides in his home plain of the battlegrounds where the rivers run red of blood as there isn't a minute that passes there without a death in the many arenas found there. Croft commonly takes the form of a large ogre wielding a battle axe. Before the second era, he usually took the form of a Morcon. Croft's two most commonly seen symbols are his helmet and axe. And that does not sound like a very nice god. I fear for my son. He looks up to his no good father, even though he's been abandoned by him. That's the thing about us ogres. We respect our fathers even if we hate them. Your dad treats you well, Gargan. He's an ass. Well, anyway. Rugmed here wants to be abandoned, and there's nothing I can say to talk him out of it. Where did Rugmed run off to anyway? Huh? I, didn't I hear he went eastward? The last word I've heard about him is that he had passed through an Enkian town of Felgruff. Passed through? Chased out by a guard, yes. You probably should have picked a better father for your child. You see Rugmed out there? Kick him for me. Whatever. I'm guessing he's gonna be an optional boss of some sort. I'll scare some senses of rug mud if I find his father out in the wild. My father is the coolest. He's a wild bandit, taking things that don't belong to him and not caring about anything. I know you're just a kid, but I hate you. Your father is worthless. Croft. Take you, Gargan. You fell mouth old brat, I'll show you. Oh, even though he worships a, a crazy god of war, I guess he's. Uh, I guess the ogres still have some rules that they must abide by. These bushes, even the bushes are suspicious. Everyone here looks the same. It's a shelf filled with various herbs, spices, and other things that aren't worth my time. Yeah. The village of Nurzov in the Kafral region was found by Pan Dog Farm Sellers in the year 4E 1985. The 
The success of the small village earned Landog his farm seller title. His son would take the title of Grim Guts after severely culling the Boar population when they started getting overly territorial. Non-ogres are welcome to visit Nurzef, but are forbidden from staying long-term as ogres are very protective of their ways and culture. The protectionist attitude makes for uncomfortable relations with the nearest Enkian settlement of Lindum due to the territory split with Caprol. Within Caprol. A number of families currently living in the village here have, uh, have been here for at least a generation, but others have moved elsewhere in recent years due to the fear of Enkians going against the agreement by Emperor Tyon. Megald and Overlord Kruga Rapson, which led to the uneasy peace within Caprol. Shuffle of various herbs. Hmm. Four coupons. Is it wrong? Is it wrong to take these if I probably plan to pay Yagel back later? My brother, Dagal, he's a rotten thief. Stay away from him. He's been stealing from me, his own brother. Mangus told me so. I stole from you too. And it looks like I have to hunt him down somehow. But where would he be? Something's fishy here and they're both too stupid to see it. I don't know why I'd help them, but Nerzov is too small to have this go on. That means I have to talk to his brother, who probably lives next door. My brother Yegel, he's a rotten thief. Stay away from him. He's been stealing from me. His old own brother, Mangus, told me so. Who is this Mangus? Where does Mangus live? And do I have to fight him? Oh, shoot. That's totally him. I'm gonna save. I think this pot. Hmm. Have you been messing with Yegel and Degel? No. Stolen goods! Have you been messing with Yagel and Dagel? No! Wait, seriously, I can just grab this and run? Uh. So it turns out that your brother was innocent. Mangus hid this in his own house. Here you go. Mangus, but he said he lied. You should have spoken to a Dagel first. Oh no, I should have... I have some apologizing to do. This has my stuff and Daggles too. Go apologize now. Here, Gargan, thanks for your help. Receive Amulet of Resist Manipulation Level 1. How ironic. Are we talk telling everybody about Mangus? My brother and I have to make have to have a serious talk. I think me and my brother will be okay. Mangus, however... Resist manipulation, huh? Manipulated must be the equivalent of confusion. But does that mean he's gonna be pissed at me now? I found my fun. My best days of banditry are behind me. I'll not slaughter those two. You, however, had better watch yourself. Watch yourself. Watch your tongue, Mangus. Let's like, you know what? I'm not gonna bother. I'm out of here. Wait, you're serious? I can execute him? This is why I try to talk to the other brother first. It wasn't your brother. I found this in Mangus' house. Here, take it. Mangus was behind this? Why did he do that? This has both mine and my brother's stuff in it. He's a terrible person. I need an apology to my brother. You don't say. Here, Gargan. Thanks for your help. Resist manipulation. It's the same reward. How ironic.
Ooh, that's technically the end of the quest, too. But I can choose what to do with, with Mangus. What happens when I try to execute you? What are you going to do? This. What? Did I seriously freaking kill him? Um. He didn't even put him a fight! What do I do? Is this right? Did I do the right thing? I don't think I should kill- should I kill- I don't think it's a good idea to kill Mangus. Vigilante Justice might put me on the bad side of the village. I don't know. If Mangus attacks me again, maybe I should consider reloading a save and killing him. Gah! Now, of course there's no guide, so I have no clue what the best choice here is. Screw it, I'm just gonna let it slide. After all, his reputation in this village is already screwed. And even if he tries to attack me again, I'll just, I don't know, eat a bunch of healing items until I can get back on my feet and pwn him. Maybe if I let it slide, I'll be able to get a boss battle with him for the sake of completionism without trying to, you know, just anticlimactically execute him somehow. Seriously, he's, he's an ogre too. Shouldn't he be able to fight back if I try to execute him? He should be fighting me axe to axe. But if I leave, am I screwed? I heard the gate is supposed to close at some point, but Trouble Wolf will probably let me teleport back in anyways. Hmm. Beware the manipulation for it only brings capitulation. You will attack a friend, then that friendship may end. Don't be scared of fate, then you'll easily evade. The attacks of your foes, you shall feel no woes. Poison weakens me, it tests my life, it does so repeatedly. I'm in such strife. My friend, can you see? No, you've been blinded. Is, is it harder to hit, or are you just absent-minded? In other words, this guy's a living tutorial. Hmm. Anything new from the uh, from uh, talking to uh, the parents? I thought they'd say something about me recruiting someone. Huh? You think they would have considered a minor accomplishment? All right, then let's just head on out. Boar. What? Oh shit, there's way too many of them. I don't know how they keep getting the first attack on me. At least that gave me a decent amount of money, but still. I'm a little worried. Holy shit, two, a two attack. The, the first boar, let's see if it redirects my attacks after the first enemy dies. No, it does not! I have to carefully allocate my attacks. Well, at least they're dropping decent money, but still. This is kind of dangerous. One wrong move and... Oh, I really should just get more armor, too. But armor here is so expensive. It's like 150. I don't know if I want to pop that much on my team, but the mo I'm getting decent, uh, better, uh, 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 better money drops now from those pigs, so maybe it'll be worth grinding. Hmm, it's going to be hard to sneak past them, isn't it? Just touch it. I'm not fast enough to possibly get past, damn it. Ugh. Whoa. Huh. Oh, I see. I have to go t to the left side first if I want to get the treasure. Shoot. Just 
got no choice but to fight that. Nope, I managed to avoid it somehow. But these enemies, they're set encounters, huh? Oh, shoot. Corva 2? Damn it, they have really high evasion! Am I even ready for them? Ugh. Blind! Sleep! This is bad! Okay, one left. How'd you miss a sleeping opponent? Ow. I just... I just need to... Contain lever armor? That's weaker than what I have now, isn't it? Yeah, it's weaker, so... Shoot. Oh, come on! Okay, let's just spam woodcutter on you. Since I'm sure most of them will miss. Oh, come on! Okay, one left. Ugh, that was close. Ogre Pendant? Two plus bonus to hit points while equipped. Hmm. Whoops. Yeah, I better go, to go get the peasant in room. Alright, let's see if we can get, reach the next save point. Shooting our pig and red fruit monster. I really wish there was a way to guarantee a first strike. That really decides the battle. Which way? Oh, there's a save point here. Who the hell is that? Only three save slots. Better use this carefully. Halt there, wanderers. We're busy. Too busy to learn about the altars of Croft? Yes. If you pray at the altar of Croft, you'll be able to recall memories of your deeds as though they happened yesterday. Recently? So it wears off if you haven't visited in a while? Will it last our whole journey? It should, yes. I hope I've been of assistance, fellow ogre. That was pretty... I already knew that. What do you think I've been doing in the village, man? Uh. But this means this... Uh, north must be... Must contain some kind of treasure or something. Huh? What's this? Antidote tonic. Where the hell is this guy? Need more potions. Need so many potions that I can basically sustain myself in the dungeon indefinitely. You better not be a mini boss or something. Go away, I Mugmore wish to be left to retire in peace. Hey now, what do you want here? Nothing. We're trying to get through the woods. Well, you're going the wrong way. Get out of here. No need for your attitude. You do best to watch yourself. Look who's talking. A mugwort. Famed adventurer. 
Never heard of you. I had a great success on Hor Horu Island. Found many treasures and slayed many foes. Then why are you out here in Nurse Woods? I'm retired. I'm already 60, you know. I probably got another couple of years before I joined the battlegrounds. Wait, why are you just staring into the river? My fishing rod broke and I'm trying to catch the fish with my hands. In full armor? I didn't live so long by not being sensible. Fair enough. No, it isn't. That's stupid. They're fish. Look, if you don't have a fishing rod that I can use, get out of here. A fishing rod? Where the hell am I going to find that? Huh. Well, I'm just going to take his stuff, because I'm going to need a lot more than he will. Potion of health. I want to avoid using potions that I can. Red potion. Empty barrel. Hmm, that's it for this area. Ah, oh, shoot. I guess I have no choice but to kill you. At least there's only one pig. Hmm, is Sir Fishing Pole back at the, s at the town? I have no clue. North and south are my options here. Okay, south or north? I think I should go south first. More of these evasive birds. They're way too powerful for me. I should avoid them whenever I can. Damn it! I don't trust myself to be able to split my attacks among them. Well, I managed to make it through unscathed that time, but... Next time, I might not be so lucky. Holy crap, is that a bonus area? Why are there so many pigs here? A red potion. I should have been more meticulous about examining them. Shoot. Are you tracking me? Holy shit, it is. Time to fight my way through. It's, it looks like a dungeon of some sort. You cannot hope to defeat. Maybe I should save this place for later. Abandoned temple. Whoa. Yeah, I'm fucked. Oh, man. Slow. It reduces my stamina and my speed, huh? Shoot, I'm screwed. They actually gonna do anything other than cast slow? Oh no, they're attacking. How much- they have way too much hit points. I can't win. Yeah, this is bad. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed this Let's Play of Tale of Enki, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit the bell icon.